Hey, Victory Outreach. Um, this is Dre. I just wanted to jump on and let you know that we are missing you and we're praying for you here at Victory Outreach Albuquerque. You know, I just wanted to share uh, this scripture. This is scripture in First Chronicles uh, chapter 13, verse 14. And it says, The ark of God remained with the family of Obed-Edom in the house for three months, and the Lord blessed the house of Obed-Edom and all that he had. So here in this story, David was going to take the Ark of the Covenant back to um, back to Israel. And Uzziah's nephew was in the leadership of Dan. And David's like, I don't want to take it back. So he put it in the house of Obed-Edom. And so what happened is while, while, the, while the Ark was there in his house for three months, it said that Obed-Edom was blessed. And all that he had was blessed. And you know what the Holy Spirit has been speaking to me is that he wants to bring the Holy Spirit back into our houses. Not that the Holy Spirit hasn't been with us, but now we have no choice. You know, when we think of church, we, or we think of, of God, we think of church. When we think of the Holy Spirit, we think of being blessed, we think of blessing, we think of church. But God is, is seeing and he's trying to, to bring the Holy Spirit right there into our, to our houses. And you know, when, when the Holy Spirit comes in our houses, how many know that our, our houses are going to be blessed? Just like Obed-Edom was blessed. So for three months, everything that he had was blessed. I believe with all my heart that as we're bringing in the Holy Spirit to our houses, as we're watching services online, as we're praying, as we're reading, as we're really seeking God, that that our houses are going to be blessed. And so in this time, yes, it's a little crazy, but you know what? Grab your Bible. Open it up. Turn on some worship music. Begin to pray. Begin to seek God. And I believe with all my heart that God is going to continue to bless us even through these crazy seasons. But uh, I just want to encourage you. I'm going to pray for you. But before that, I want to remind you, don't forget to check out our services Wednesdays at 7, Sundays at, at 10 o'clock a.m. and Friday nights for 7.30 for our gang, God's Anointed Now Generation service. But let me pray for you. Father God, I pray, God, for every person that is watching this, that you would continue to bless their households, God, as we bring the Holy Spirit and we're inviting it here into our houses. We pray that you would bless us and you would just take care of us, God. We, we trust you. In Jesus' name we pray, amen and amen.